All right, let's get this one. This time around, we're going to be adding the AMD compatibility rig for our armature. What we want to do is grab all our layers, first of all, and put them into a single layer. So let's go to edit. Let's grab all our layers and select all and move them all to layer one. So now they're all live here. And once we do an MD rigify compatibility, uh, all our layers, where which is going to be our original bones, will be set to this layer right here. That way you can easily find them and once you do an export, you can easily just pick them and export all of them at once without any of the extra rigified ones, if you so choose to do so. So let's get our rigified going. Let's go to our uh, MD panel, select your bones, and you want to select the add. Uh, Meta rig. Once this one's set, it created this rig, which is a pretty much a same copy of what you have, but it's in a format that the uh, rig of five add-on will understand and create the unnecessary components. Let's go now to our little dancing dude. Which data properties for bones and down here it just says rigify bugs. Open that up and we can have a rigify, uh, I mean, <laughs> generate rig. Let's create that one. It's going to take a little while for that one to process while it's making all the uh, data blocks or whatever it's doing in the background. And it's going to generate our uh, control uh, bones, which is this ones. Right now, this one is not attached to our model. And we have an option here to for the add-on. We can make a Riga 5 fully compatible one, which is going to be more for a like custom animations. And a MMD compatible one, which is going to be compatible with most of the MMD motion files. That is what we want to do for ourselves. Our meta rig, we no longer need. So you can delete it or for me, I'm just going to target it off. I am going to be saving uh this file in meta rig just so we can have a little backup at this point because once we go from here we can't really go back and here you're gonna go grab your uh rigify rig and also shift control and my screencasts are not on All right, so here, here, select our rig of five, select your armature, scroll all the way down, and we're going to select MMD compatibility rig. From here, now you can see there are model has now been fully integrated with our Rigify rig. And now you can pause it, add it, and I have a little mistake here, which apparently I missed a couple of my waypoints. That is to be fixed as a little time after I'm done with this video. With this however now we can add a motion file 
Let's go over here to set our motions. Let's just grab a simple one. And this add uh, also make sure you uh treat this post according to this post. Usually fixes any minor issues you might have. And now our model is fully animatable with our in the motions. And we had our faces working, but we have a little problem with the uh waypoints down here. Don't mind that. And there you go. This is how you set up your armature to be Rigify compatible. Let's go back. One thing I did notice that it doesn't happen until you actually save the file. That if you want to change to your IKF case, they don't quite work. But they do work after you reopen up this uh, file. So let's go. Let me undo until I added the motion. Let's save this file. So this is rig six. Let's open up that file. So this will be just like a little example if you want to toggle off your IK in F case. So let's grab that. Let's move it around there. Now you, you can see your I case in F case now do work. I'm not really sure if I have an add on that's making this error or not, but this is a way how to fix them. And if you want to toggle on your AFK uh, or your IK controls, just go the way down. And here you toggle those on. And now you have this guy's working. Let's go up here. And now you have this little one. All right, so we have this little issue fixed. Let's go, we close this one, go back to the previous one, and I'm going to revert back. If it works, ah, oh, damn it, it didn't go the way back. Okay, so let me open up the file before I did the... Uh, to do where are you? Where are you? Here we go. Before I did the MMD compatible version, and let's create a Riga 5 a compatible one, and let's see the general differences. So, right now, this is not attached to our model. Let's create this one compatible now for a Rigify of one, Rigify of integration. And right off the bat, you can see the bones look slightly different. Let's go to post mode, screencast keys, MD, all right. That's on now. And by default, our model is working with IK controls. Let's save this model. Uh, Rigify. Okay, so we have this model saved. And if we want to toggle our IK in F case, there's going to be the same issue 
where they're not being turned on or off with the slider. So here's where our FK is supposed to be and they're not moving. So once again, let me open up the save file. It's going to be this one. Let a while for it to open. Let's move that hand. And now we go to item. Now our I case and F case toggle switch works. Toggle those on. Let's select all G. Uh, Go away. L, R, G, and S. So we can reset our model. Grab our bones. And let's add a motion file. It's clear in mind that this is our, our Riga 5 compatible version. And down here, import file let's import the same one treat green post as rest post and if we place play first of all our hands are in an IK position so they're not moving since their motion is using FK so let's grab our arms and let's move them into their FK position and now we can place play but one thing you have noticed is that our center bone does not exist in this uh, model so our model is no longer moving up down left or right or rotating anymore it's this place is just uh, static. So in this Riga 5 version, your MND uh, motions will not be compatible. You have to manually move them around uh, yourself, a key Freeman. So just make sure you grab the proper uh, rig type for your purposes however this model if you want to do uh, some custom animations this one is going to be a whole lot easier to animate since it has just exactly what you need and no extra uh, fuss with this uh, let me conclude this video and you can pick whatever you choose from here on out.